hitting that record button feels a little foreign i'm not gonna lie hey how are you <laughs> i hope you're doing good it has been a long time since i've uploaded a youtube video and it's actually been about two years i checked on my channel before filming i'm feeling a little weird in front of the camera i I'm gonna need some time to get kind of reacquainted, but I didn't want that to hold me back from just starting things up again. Yeah, so I wanted to kind of share where I've been and you know where I'm at now since I last uploaded a video. Um, so yes, two years ago, I was living in Florida at the time, and since then I moved to Colorado. My husband and I relocated here, and yeah, a lot of life has happened in the past two years, and it's been really good, but. I really needed to press pause on YouTube for a few reasons. Yeah, once we moved, it was kind of a matter of figuring out, you know, where's our new church? Like, what, what do our new friend groups look like? Where am I going to go to the gym? Like, all that kind of thing. And so since then, I mean, I already stopped vlogging even a year before we moved. So for me, it was I was out of the habit anyway. But I still had this feeling of wanting to pick up the camera and... I just felt that like lack of creative like outlet if you will and I've had other creative outlets but I really do love YouTube deep down it's always been something that I've loved and yeah so I actually lost my vlog camera in the move so there's that so once I kind of came to this point of yeah I want to like pick up the vlog camera again and start filming I'm like shoot I don't even know where my camera is so anyway we found the camera recently and I said you know what that means I need to just start filming again I need to just do it I'm not gonna wait for the perfect time the perfect place and moment and all of that I'm just going to start uh, because honestly that's what really held me back and that was another reason why I stopped filming when I did um, when we were kind of selling the house and in that time frame. I had been filming my videos at that point for a while and I think it just wasn't going the way that I thought it would or the way that I expected and at the time I was honestly really hoping it could turn into something more and that it could be you know my full-time job and it could be my main source of income and I wanted to do it a because I loved it but b because I wanted that to be my job and I know that's possible so I was like all right let's do this thing and along the way it just became something that felt like something I had to do versus something that I wanted to do and it just wasn't as fun anymore I was filming but then I felt you know oh my gosh I have all this footage I have to edit and all of that and the numbers weren't picking up for me and I was at the time very you know paying close attention to the vanity metrics, you know, the subscriber count, the follower count on Instagram, all of that, because I knew that that didn't define my worth and that didn't like put any more value on myself. But at the same time, I wanted to grow so I could turn it into something and that wasn't happening. So then I was getting frustrated and I was wondering, you know, what am I doing wrong? This is a waste of time. And and you know, I spiraled from there. So I just stopped altogether. I was at this point of, you know what? This isn't worth it for me right now. It's just not what I want it to be. I don't wanna have this kind of relationship with vlogging. So fast forward to now, and I've taken a, obviously a considerable amount of time off. And I've really been able to reflect, you know, what are my goals with YouTube and with being active on social media and I would say I genuinely want it to be a true hobby at this point. I'm really not looking at it as a way to make an income or even become my full-time job one day because now I do have a job that I genuinely love that I don't feel like I need to go like searching for something else. But now I do work in marketing full-time and I do a lot of social media management and I do a lot of creative work. So now I really want, you know, this space to be truly a hobby and a creative outlet and a place that I get to come to. I get to edit and I get to just do it for fun outside of work because uh, I think it's important that we all have, you know, hobbies and, you know, passion projects and things that we're doing outside of our main 
job. So that transitions into what I want my content to be focused around at this point in the game. And that really is, you know, days in the life, weeks in the life, just like overall productivity style content. And that's not to say that productivity is everything because I think there's a point where it can get to be a little too much and we all need that like self-care and we need to have rest days and stuff like that. But I'm really excited to start sharing that with you and kind of get back into the swing of things with YouTube. So bear with me if I'm ever awkward in front of the camera or if I just am stumbling around my words because I'm like, man, it truly has been a while. I also travel for work, so I've even thought about, you know, making some vlogs around that versus just like the reels that I've been doing. So if you are into that sort of thing, I would love for you to subscribe to the channel and just kind of hang out and join me along the journey. Otherwise, keep on the lookout for the next video. I am going to be doing a kind of like productivity style vlog to just kick things off. And really, it's going to be a lot of just getting back into a routine because um, lately I've been super busy and just kind of putting all that on the back burner. So I feel like when I have those days to truly like reset and get all my systems in order, I just feel so great. <laughs> like it just feels right. So that's really it for today. If you're excited about the content that I've mentioned coming up, definitely give this video a like and even share a comment down below of, you know, what you're most excited about seeing. I would just love to know that you personally are here and we can just kind of build up this community and truly just make it a fun space. That's my goal is just to have fun with it, honestly. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.